every single day when you wake up in the morning, you ask yourself, what other people think about myself? Do they like me? Do they like how I behave to them? And by thinking this consistently, you build up your character in a way that you actually have no type of character in yourself. The main thing that prioritizes your character is what other people think about me. And to basically be a person who is like a statue. Like a statue cannot do anything. He just stays silent all the time. And other people might like him. Other people might hate him. But no one can particularly say that I hate that guy for this reason. Because he didn't do did harm to me. And that's what I have become in the last few years. And I think my internet addiction and YouTube addiction has played a great role in this thing. I now feel why kids should not get an exposure to internet and YouTube in their early ages. There's a reason behind that. I know, watching YouTube might give you a job, but overwatching YouTube might be the reason why you have lost your job. Consistently consuming internet makes you feel like you are a person who doesn't have particularly interest in anything. You just feel like you are a dumb person, you cannot do anything, and it's really bad. The feeling makes you feel worse every single day, and the time gets passed. Once the time is get passed, you feel that if you just have tried a little bit more, you could do a lot better than what you currently have. When I have no time, I understand the value of the lost time. Doing procrastination, screwing up your grades and result has become a common thing in myself. If I just forget about everything that's happening around the world and just keep tracking on what my main task is to do, I think that things could be a lot better. I think sometimes you need to be a little bit selfish and try to get your job done. Like for example in my case that study. I don't. I might just try to forget my past and try to start working from today. Because this is a do now or never type situation. I guess trying to be a social media influencer is great. But try to think about yourself. Is it better to be a person who is respected by all but doesn't have a lot of earning? Or is it better to be a person who cares a lot of money but he doesn't have respect to anyone? What's your opinion about that? I'm probably still gonna make videos on YouTube, still gonna do cubing, but I just regret about my addiction on YouTube and the internet itself. Just consuming thousands of videos about different situations, different type of opinions and other things have crushed my mind. I never really wanted to know what happened it to Lunchly, what happened it to Prime, what happened it to Mr. Beast. I never really wanted to know any situations. I didn't like the internet drama anytime. I don't care about Mr. Beast by any means. But I just keep consuming them. I don't know. Like, I started watching something. I just keep watching that for a shit amount of time and I know that lost time is never going to come back anymore. And I feel like if I just didn't spend those unnecessary times in, you know, watching YouTube videos, watching random people's lifestyle and things like that, I could have just spent that time probably making my own video scripts and, you know, doing better in studies. I actually did really, really bad in my last exam. I passed the exam, but my GPA wasn't in to the point, which is expected from. So, there's going to be my exam on coming December. Oh, sorry, not December, January, I guess. Or January, how you say that. That's in like fun weapon. And so, the main thing is that I'm probably quieting into it. I don't know if I just come back on YouTube once again and I'm not leaving YouTube. I would come back again pretty strongly. But 
just to kill my internet addiction and procrastination, I need to take a step. Otherwise, after a few years, I would have nothing. I would not have good grades, no good universities, not a job at all. I, you know, I I didn't got a single dollar paid by YouTube. If you'd like see, I have a one key subscribers. I have views in some of my videos. If you think I got beat, not a single dollar. Keep that in mind. I think, I think things should get changed in the future. Thanks for watching. See you guys saw it anytime soon. So yeah, that's what I just wanted to say. And yeah, if you just like the video, just like it, subscribe, that's your matter. I don't know about the future of this channel, about my cubing future. There's been a lot of Rubik's Cube competition in Bangladesh recently. Uh, there's going to be a comp in Chattogram this November, then there's going to be in with But I cannot attempt there. Also, big exam and stuff like that. It's just kind of disturbing. And if I just feel like I just didn't cube greatly just because of my internet addiction, like I would just do some mindless thoughts and then just keep watching YouTube forever. That's, I mean, that is really, really, really bad. So, see you guys on the next one. <laughs>